The patient chart book is the patient's unified medical record in the NABID clinical portal. In this session, you will learn about the patient chart and its various elements. Click the downward facing arrow next to chart book to access the different tabs contained in the chart book. You will see different tabs that contain distinct categories of clinical information. Please note that the NABID clinical portal is a read-only portal. Therefore, when you open the unified record in NABID, you can only read and view the record. You cannot edit, update, or delete any clinical information in NABID. You should continue to use your EMR system to capture clinical information. We encourage you to incorporate the NABID clinical portal as part of your existing clinical workflow. The first tab is the clinical summary. This is a summary of the different tabs listed below clinical summary. It provides a summary of the historical medical information of the patient that you are viewing. It enables you to view a summary of your patient's essential information across all key clinical domains. For example, diagnosis, lab results, allergies, diagnostics, medications, documents, etc. You can sort the information from here. To view more details, click the icon with three dots. This will open additional details behind that entry. The next tab is Conditions. This tab lists all the diagnoses that were captured for this patient in their previous visits to healthcare facilities within the NABID network. In this section, you can view the patient's diagnosis, current and historical problem lists for improved clinical decision making. A number of diagnoses were captured at different healthcare facilities that are part of the NABID network. Therefore, this information is now a part of the patient unified record in the NABID clinical portal. Nothing was captured under the current problems and historical problems, which is why it's blank. The next tab is allergies. Any allergy that is associated with the patient and was captured in the respective healthcare facilities EMR system, which is part of the NABID network, can be seen here. A number of allergies were captured under these healthcare facilities, so they are now included in the patient's unified record in NABID. Easy access to your patient's allergy list aids safer diagnosis and treatment. The next tab is medications. This section includes the list of the medication orders that were placed for this patient as part of their previous visits and encounters. Therefore, you can view your patient's current and past medication orders to avoid contraindications or re-prescribing. On the right-hand side, under Details, click the three dots to view further details related to a particular medication order. The next tab is Documents. Any structured clinical document that was associated with the patient's visit and is shared with NABID is included in the unified medical record. Clinical documents such as discharge summaries can be viewed in this section. Click the underlined document name to view the document. On the top left of the screen, Click Back to EPR to go back to the patient's clinical summary. The next tab is Immunizations. This section lists all the immunizations and the vaccinations that have been administered to the patient in healthcare facilities within the NABID network. Therefore, you can view your patient's immunization history and advise accordingly. On the right-hand side, under Details, 
Click the three dots to view further details about the immunization. The next tab is Vital Signs. This section lists all the vitals that were captured in the patient's encounter in any healthcare facility within the NABID network. Therefore, you can view your patient's vital history to help drive better overall health and wellness. If you scroll down, you can also view the trends associated with your patient's vitals and take any necessary action that may be required. The next tab is Lab Results. This section lists all the lab tests that the patient has taken in any of the healthcare facilities within the NABID network. Therefore, you can view your patient's lab results from other facilities to avoid duplicate testing and provide a better patient experience. If any lab test result is highlighted in red, this indicates that the lab test result is outside the reference range determined by the testing lab. The next tab is Diagnostic Studies. This section lists all the results from diagnostic tests that the patient has completed in any healthcare facility within the NABID network. Therefore, you can view your patient's diagnostic reports from other facilities to avoid duplicate testing and provide a better patient experience. Kindly note that images from diagnostic tests are not available on NABID. To view the report, click the relevant underlined report. The next tab is Procedures. This section lists all the procedures that the patient has undergone in any healthcare facility within the NABID network. These details were documented in the electronic medical record system of the healthcare facilities where the procedures were performed on the patient. Therefore, easy access to your patient's past procedures will help drive better overall health and wellness. The next tab is Histories. In this section, you can view the patient's medical history, social history, family history, and social determinants. The next tab is Encounters. This section lists all the various encounters that the patient has completed across different healthcare facilities within the NABID network. For example, the patient had an emergency encounter in MediClinic City Hospital, which is part of the NABID network. Therefore, the encounter and the related clinical details are now part of the patient's unified record in NABID. The next tab is care team. This section lists all the care team members who have treated the patient across different healthcare facilities within the NABID network. Visibility into care teams allows clinicians to collaborate with clinicians from other healthcare facilities within the NABID network. The next tab is cohorts. This section lists all the cohorts that were added to the patient's unified record in NABID. You can create these cohorts easily within the NABID clinical portal. It is a way for healthcare professionals to create a consolidated list of patients for their own personal use. From here, you can create a list for you to monitor and to organize your work. For example, if the patient is diagnosed with diabetes, you can create a cohort for diabetes and add the patient to this cohort. Patients with similar diagnoses that you treat in the future can be added to this cohort. The next tab is demographics. This section displays information related to the demographics of the patient, along with the patient's personal contact details and emergency contact details. The patient contact details are easily accessible and it allows you to reach out to the listed emergency contact in case of any emergency. Information from the various healthcare facilities in the NABID network is updated in near real time in the NABID clinical portal. To capture, edit, update, or delete any clinical information, 
Please continue to use your healthcare facilities electronic medical record, the EMR system.